Hi, folks. You know, ever since a couple years ago, I heard about circular breathing. First, I read something about Kenny G doing it, and then I became very interested, and I thought it was a fabulous thing. And uh, always amazed me in the back of my mind after that. Last year, I went to a Cleveland Instant Music concert, and I saw this girl there, Eleanor Rufizen or something. I'm not sure how to pronounce her name. She's on Facebook. She was playing clarinet. And um, I saw her circular breathing, and her stuff was incredible. I mean, it was mind blowing, and her um, her circular breathing was incredible. Also, it was so smooth. So after that, I became fascinated. I decided I wanted to learn how to do it myself. I started telling everyone, "Yeah, you should learn how to circular breathing." You know, then I was watching Trombone Shorty, and I saw that he was circular breathing, and because he has very good muscle definition on his body, you could see what he's doing exactly. I saw it on his, muscle, on his cheeks were three sets of muscles, you know, and I was trying to watch him. I watched her a couple hours, close of his face, circular breathing over and over again. Then a couple weeks ago, I was somewhere, and um, there was a show for there on the shelf. I took it off, and I started blowing it, and I said to myself, let me see if I can circular breathe. Now, as a singer, I know about how the lungs and stuff like that work. It's part of what I do, and control the face muscles, you know, the difference between this voice and this voice. This voice, this voice, you know, and different places we're using it. It requires, you know, I'm always trying to achieve complete control of my facial muscles. In general, the, you know, singing requires, proper singing requires control of the whole body. But um, especially the fine muscles in the face and you have the neck and the diaphragm and other things like that. Um, the diaphragm is huge, you know, it goes around the whole, uh, from, the top, from the top of your pelvis to the top of your lungs. But anyway, uh, or bottom of your lungs or something like that, it pushes up your lungs goes over the viscera, I think. Um, regardless, I'm into facial muscles, uh, controlling them. So I, I was already pretty close there. So let me just show you what I forgot how to do. I started doing this a few weeks ago, and now I'm going to demonstrate for all those who don't believe me. Circular breathing is you catch the air on your cheeks, and you use that to exhale while you're inhaling through your nose to keep up a long breath. Let me see if I can do it right now. bad one one more time perfect but you get the uh, drift of it I'll try and make a lot of videos see if it comes out better